Today I'm protesting about corrupt politicians. Is Malcolm Turnbull in bed with the banks? I say yes. Do they care about us or do they care about their big corporate mates? Do they care about, about us only once every three years? How cheaply do they sell us down the, the toilet to large corporations? Turnbull said no to a Royal Commission into the banks despite a Senate inquiry recommending that we have a Royal Commission into the banks. The Greens and Labor back a Royal Commission into the banks and the, the rip-offs that they've been doing. The Senate found that ATSIC is a timid, is a timid law enforcer. So why are the Liberals backing ATSIC to do the job? Why has ATSIC not launched any investigations despite thousands of cases of fraud? The ANZ Bank deliberately falsified my loan documents. The ANZ secretly increased my income from $41,500 to $158,400, which is an increase of 400%, and fraudulently reduced my expenses by 74%. So they did that on the loan application document. The Financial Ombudsman and ATSIC refused to act when I complained about ANZ fraud. On Tuesday, I conducted a citizen's arrest on ANZ Bank because the authorities refused to investigate these crimes. And I wanted to highlight that they're just doing nothing. Predatory lending is where a bank lends money to someone who can't repay a loan. This affects 150,000 people in Australia the ANZ often preys on elderly people and often takes their home. Everyone with a home loan should request a copy of their application document. So the application form from their bank and check if there's any fraud. If it was a low doc loan, it's very likely that there's fraud. On um, full documentation loans, quite often there's fraud as well. You may be entitled to compensation. Banks are giving the Liberal Party millions of dollars for this election, for their election campaign. Vote Green or vote Labor for a Royal Commission into the banking sector.